file, I'm uh, heading down to the beach and to the water inside. I'm gonna find a couple coins. You can see the weather, it looks nice. But if we check to this side, it does not, it does not <laughs> see any good. And actually I feel some raindrops, but I think it it's have to be more to stop me. <laughs> I really want to go out, so. Um, get back to when I'm on the field and hopefully find my first organ. Hi all, uh, I have uh, set up my equipment and uh, we're back on this lawn here. You can see it's something to dig. I'm gonna try to uh, move a little bit strategic along the sides. Uh, so we'll see what, what will pop up. Um, it's a very weird weather here now. You see that does not look good, but all up here looks good. But as you can see, over there, there, there's no, nothing good about that. But keep going till, uh, till something tell us not to do. And after two pull tabs, we managed to get one crown coming from there, sitting there. So it's been about five minutes, I think. It's a modern one. 1980, so sweet. Well, this proves that after three guys have walked around the whole, the whole area here, uh, still some uh, coins are around. So keep going. After I've been digging up a uh, modern one era, uh, you can see first silver for today. And it's 25 Ara. It's from 53. Well, it's still silver. I'm gonna check the hole once again because it sounded real, real light. And it's out. Well, keep going. Hello, everybody. Uh, it's uh, getting a little bit hot. Uh, as you can see, the sun is really, really, really getting to me. Either way, I'm uh, keep going. I'm getting uh, uh, tanned, or what <laughs> burned in the sun, but it's nice. So I'm getting brown. Either way, we got uh, uh, another silver coin. You can see there, tan out It's not been too good. Actually, it's been a Real quiet, quiet for, for some time, putting up some modern coins, but 1953. So, this is good. Keep going the line. Oh, it's, uh, it's getting real, real, real hot. Uh, just now, I, I did shout over all the area uh, because my bag is laying there, and a kid, uh, maybe four years. His parents walking down, he running up to my uh, bag. He opened it up and start to uh, looking for something. So I gelled, I shelled and I think I gelled like Mufasa style. Well, that was high and everybody was looking at me. <laughs> Either way, he should not touch my bag. It's not his. Either way. Uh, see this? So hopefully, maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, it could be an old copper. Uh, you see that last time I found a five hora and it kind of looked like this, but I think this coin is bigger and uh, it looks old. You see the side of it. So hopefully we have found another coin that is old. Hopefully. But I'm gonna clean it up later. See what it is. And it I've gone some hours now. I'm really really getting exhausted soon, but I cannot quit. See why? That's why. Not a copper coin. 
have no idea, I cannot see anything on it. But it looks old. Damn, it feels good. Keep going. Hi all, uh, I'm back again. Um, I had uh, I have had a cold from yesterday. I was uh, quite beaten up in the sun. I was. Uh, you can see if I can. This is what I what my skin looks like. Here's what you can see today. So yeah, a bit. Uh, I did uh, uh, take some uh, my fiance's uh, some cream for the skin. The, about five times each arm, and in my face. This hunt that I that we that I was on uh, turned out to be quite good. Either way, I didn't want to stop. We got clad. I finally have learned that uh, I can call this clad. It's not have to be American coins. So uh, one krona, one, two, three, four, five, and you can see eighty, eighty one. 78, 78, 81. Uh, so this one you can use today. A casing. Uh, this two is weird. It does not have. It looks like coins, but it's half, it doesn't have anything on it. It's just blank. Uh, two of those. Not in the same hole, but still weird. Five out of. 54, 2 out of 58, 53, 5 out of the 70s, 1 out of 69, in a modern clad, it's just useless, we don't use these coins anymore. Uh, then we have two silvers, not too much to brag about, uh, 1 out of 5 out of 53 and 10 out of 53. Uh, the those coins that I want to brag about, uh, of course, it's not in the best shape, but with my little book, we can try to find. You can see here. I have to go back. The first one we can take it's from the 17th century. Here we are. It's uh, one of these I found is from Olo Frederick. And if we can get a picture of him. There we have him. And I did find one of those. You can see the crowns. You have one, two, three crowns. You have the letters on the top. You can try to get a better. The date shall be standing there, but it's bent. Uh, this side was better. So, it could be from, I think this one is uh, uh, one hora. yes it's one hora. Uh, 1768 to 7, no okay, 1768, if I'm not, 1768, if, not, uh, if I'm not being uh, mistaken me. Then, this one is very beaten up. I can hardly see anything on it. I think I see a crown there. And this one helped me. You can see a date up there. It's 1 6. And there's another date. I don't, cannot see it. Then you have this. 
uh, a form of a shield of a crown. You have a uh, R. If we now go back, this is this is good. All the way to 16, 16. I thought it was that uh, one of those, but as the date is on the top here, and it's not a crown that's you, that you can see down there. Go back, go more back. Sixteen. Now we're talking. Christina. Here. Here we have it. It's wine one and four euro. <laughs> and it's from it's from 16, 1633 to sixteen thirty four copper. I I have break my record again. It, it's this is for me. It's very 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 very, very cool. I really get excited. Actually, now when I look, yet I see a tree there. So, if you compare these two, you can lay it down. And yes, we have an old coin, <laughs> a copper. <clears throat> On the same site that we found the others, so... Uh, Finally, it starts to be. Finally, it starts to happen stuff. Uh, I um, must, uh, according to Swedish law, uh, contacting uh, the county board uh, to report the fines, and which I will, because I don't want to get it. Uh, for me or for others, others that had, has this hobby, any more problems. Uh, but as you can see, <laughs> uh, it's it's wow for me. <laughs> my grandparents and my mom come from, um, are uh, are from New Shopping. New Shopping is a town in Sweden, and uh, it has some stories about uh, I cannot exactly the kings the. the King's name now, but he had two or one brother, and they was in the New Shopping's castle and had uh, food and eat food and uh, drink and so on. Uh, then it was competition for the crown, and one of those did lock his uh, brothers in a tower, throw, throw them down, and uh, lock the door and throw the key to the New Shopping's river. That uh, <coughs> going. <coughs> Uh, just outside the castle, so that's a quite neat story. But it's fun to find one of those coins. I cannot still understand that. It, it's about, it's soon 400 years old, and I found it here in the town that got its uh, beginning of the population. You call it? Uh, it was founded a city. It was founded a city. Uh, in uh, the end of uh, 1500s and uh, it could not be, have been too much people hanging around here because it's a very small town uh, the town that I live in is uh, mentioned in a letter in the uh, 1200th century uh, in a letter from uh, a con con convict I think <laughs> a comic uh, with nuns that said that the place is uh, Mykrids Bodar, that's in Latin, so it means Mökkens Bodar, and uh, Mökken is the lake that we, we, you have seen on the video that I, we were close to and digging. Uh, Mökkens Bodar, it <laughs> was just uh, some farms, nothing else. Uh, but I think it was maybe, the, the, of course they had people working for them and 
and so on. So, of course, they drop money. Thank you for watching. And uh, today, I'm a very happy Swede. Take care all and happy hunting.